Hi, I'm Christy. Hi, I'm Kelly. I'll be your examiner. Okay. I have some directions I'm going to read to you and then we'll begin. The skill is designed to evaluate your ability to control hemorrhage. This is a scenario-based evaluation. As you progress through the scenario, you will be given various signs and symptoms appropriate for the simulated patient's condition. You'll be required to manage the simulated patient based on these signs and symptoms. You may use any of the supplies and equipment available in this room. You have 10 minutes to complete this skill. Please take a few moments and familiarize yourself with your equipment before we begin and let me know if you have any questions. Okay. I don't have any questions. Okay. I'll read you your scenario now. Okay. You respond to a stabbing and find a 25-year-old female patient. Upon examination, you find a 2-inch stab wound to the inside of her left arm at the antecubital fossa. Bright red blood is spurting from the wound. The scene is safe and the patient is responsive and alert. Her airway is open and she is breathing adequately. Do you have any questions? I don't. BSI, I'm going to come up here and immediately hold direct pressure and elevate the extremity. The wound continues to bleed. Okay. Ma'am, can you put your hand here and hold this? I'm going to get the tourniquet and put the tourniquet as close to the wound as I can. has been controlled. Okay. Your patient is now exhibiting signs and symptoms indicative of hypoperfusion. Okay, I'm going to lay her on the ground. Ma'am, can you lay on the ground? And I'm going to have you put your feet up on this chair. I'm going to cover her up with a blanket to make her keep her warm. I'm going to apply oxygen on her and I'm going to transport immediately and I'm done with the station. Thank you. Thanks. 